What's up Brick Builders? Today's build is the People Set, set number 205, year it came out was 1978, age group 7 plus, uh, number of parts 120, price per piece is 6 pence, cost back in 1978 was £7.10. Current value right now, a mint sealed box, you're looking at £74. Used, it's kind of unknown, but £37 to £41-ish. £37 to £41-ish. What is that? The... Um, Hello folks, welcome to Britain Bricks, uh, or should I say, this is Sean from Britain Bricks. Welcome to another video that's just really not started very, very well at all. This is a universal building set, so this is a basic building set. Um, this particular build we're going to do is like a wedding party. Uh, there is no instructions for it, but it is a very basic build. So let's check it out. Okay, so here's our parts, and these are maxi figures. So we got the maxi figure head there, we've got the one with the glasses, and we've got one with some freckles, and we've got normal basic smile, which was that. The, no, this is the second version, I think, because it's got the eyebrows going over. Um, then we got the mustache, which is quite a rare. Very good print on that. Um, and yeah the other thing that's fairly rare is this red hair it came in black and the ultimate rare piece in this set is the top hat that is rare uh let's um i'm going to show you the picture that i'm working from so this is the picture i'm working from that's all we've got to go by so what we're going to do, we'll start off with the left maxi figure and work our way to the right. So that looks like a 2x3 red plate, 2x2 two two yellow brick, and then a 2x4 blue brick. And these pieces here, I had to wait for these to come in. I only had one. And trying to find someone who had one, <laughs> quite hard. Uh, this uh, angle piece is a uh, two by two by three. And we've got to put two of those together. That makes the dress bottom. And then it looks like we've got a blue plate. Two by two blue plate, possibly. Maybe it's not. Maybe it's just shadow. Looks like a blue plate. I got uh, a two by three there. That's his foot. Could be, could be a black plate. No, there you go. There's a blue plate. Found it for the waistband type thing. And then it's a red body. So we got these red bodies with the hole in the top for the head, and then these pieces turn round. These are the hinged shoulders. So I pop that on there. And then we're going to give her arms. So we got this piece here has three fingers and two fingers. And we want a sleeve that's going to go on the two fingers. And you're just going to push them together and they will go click like that. This hole here, that will house the hand. And back in the 70s, these were the hands, the maxi figure hands. Came in two different types. Um, and got various different colors as well. There's a couple of them that came out in red. Um, I'll, just, I'll try opening this bag. These bags are awful to open, aren't they? <laughs> Especially when you, <laughs> when, when you want to open them. Oh dear, this is the challenge. We got the whole video of me watching, uh, watching me uh, open a bag. Oh my gosh. So back in the day um, when I was a uh, kid, was it? Uh, this is 1978, right? So I was eight years old when this came out. And there we go. So we got a round hole, and you also have one with a hex, kind of a hexagonal hole. 
these are round holes proper for this period and that is going to go in there and that is the hand so we're going to join that to the shoulder and that's one and these particular elements the uh, the arms they were used for all sorts of things like uh, uh, crane grabs and stuff like that for space sets so we're going to join the other ones together put the hand in you got that little stud on the end there that you could pin like um, a Lego brick that looked like a carton of milk or something like this this one's going to hold a present but you'd have a little bottom on there as well as a carton of milk or it could be like a bottle or it could be a dumbbell that's what that uh, that was stud was for so this Maxi Fig has the freckles. Oh, we could put the moustache on. <laughs> it's got the freckles. And it's got the black hair. Now you say, uh, I was telling you earlier on that this was, this was only available in black. There's your black version. And black was very common. So for the sake of the picture, she has the bangs is it bangs <laughs> fringe <laughs> over the top and she's gonna be holding a present so that's going to be a white brick because you know that's what they've always wanted is a white brick so you put that in your hand uh, like so and there you go <clears throat> she's ready to hand her present over so that's the first one and then we're going to do this very spiffing looking chap and uh, he's got a two by three black plate two by three black plate see a two by two oh no did I I got one. I got one. There we go. Two by three black plate. And then it's two, two by two square bricks. And then it looks like these two here, these one by two sloped bricks are gonna be on the back. That's going to be like his tail coat. So we've got to have a two by uh, one by two black brick in front like that. Then we've got another two by two black brick. And then we've got this white. Could be a cummerbund. Uh, for his waist. And then he has a black body. So we've got the black body. And then we've got the arms, and so we've got the arms. Again, put them together. And the hand. Pop that into his shoulder, like that. These always got broken back in the day um it's it's quite a find to find one of these with the uh, uh the uh fingers complete there we go but yeah these these were your minifigures in the days folks these were the minifigures in the days can you imagine having a blind bag of these right so then he has his splendid mustache oh my gosh that is so cool All right and then we got his top hat and that we're gonna do him in the same pose as what he's in so he's gonna have his arm around the bride he could be 
who could be the father of the bride. So we're gonna do the bride next. Now she looks a little bit tricky. So that's a two by three plate with a two by two plate, two by four plate, sorry. And then we have a longish overflow of dress here. We thought we would have the two by two white brick. Got one there. She's got one. I'll take your brick for now. And then two by four. That looks like two two by fours. Two by four whites. <coughs> Might not have one of those in my stash. Oh, I do have a, I do have a two by two though. Hey, I got two by four. Here we go. Here we go. So now you can have your brick back, aren't you, Lucky? There you go. Put your hand under it. Perfect. All right. Then another two by two angled bricks. Or sloped bricks, sorry. And then she's got a two by two. Oh dear, I've got to take the. <laughs> I'm short of a few two by twos here. Um, I got a load of one by ones though. Maybe they're being made up by the one by ones. Very possibly like that. Yeah. Have your brick back. Go get fed up of me taking a brick. Uh, and then we've got the white body. Very cool. And the arms and the sleeves. Put those together. that in there shoulder turn it around be nice and careful with turning it around because that's how they got snapped off try bending it the wrong way instead of twisting it it's quite rare to find these not chewed <laughs> some reason they uh they were better than gum all right so now she's gonna have uh the head with the eyebrows oh that was a leg <clears throat> or shoes not white shoes there we go and we could give her the red hair and she's going to have them hanging over like that. Very cool. She looks very smart. And then we're going to put a bouquet of flowers in her hand. So we've got this piece here. We've got a pop. A couple of flowers on there. So, uh, three, and then we go stack. And put the other three on. <coughs> I got the flowers upside down. Not 
there. And we're missing one. Where is it? Are we? One, two, three, four, five. Yep. I bet it's a white one. No, it's not. It's a, it's a red one. It's a red one. Right, now I know what colour to look for. Usually they go into the bricks, which is quite fun. Are you under the hat? No. You get stuck inside the bricks. I check the bag. That's always good. Oh. I remember Mando had a bouquet of flowers. Here we go. Red. Gotta put it the right way up. So I've got a couple of them upside down and a couple of them right way up. Kind of breaks up that that monotony. There we go. That's the bouquet of flowers. And we just go pop that into her hand like that and cover up her face so we go drop your hand down and kind of tilt it perfect you can now loop your arm around the old chap there i think the arm usually goes underneath doesn't it when you do that i think try and twist these There we go. And then we got this, uh, this other person here that's uh, in blue. I wonder why we got the inverted. Because it, it is a universal building set. So there are going to be various different pieces. So this one has a 2 by 3 plate. And then a couple of red bricks. There's about three red bricks by those things. 2 by 2 red bricks. looks like three two three we've got uh, two by two and a two by two here we go uh, one by two and one by two sorry and we got these blue two by two sloped bricks enough like that and then we got blue brick and then a blue brick. I think that's two. And then the body. And this is a blue body. And you're going to have an arm and a sleeve. And a hand. You always have a hand. Pop that in the shoulder. Boink. And then the last arm. There we go. It's quite a rare thing to find these in good condition as well because these would always get chewed. And click. And you're going to have your hand on your hip like so. And then you're going to wave as soon as you put your body back together. There we go. Perfect pose. And then you're going to have the glasses. And you're going to have the brown hair. Okay, I'm going to have the smooth side because you can have two sides to the hair there we go very cool 
And that is your wedding pie. You get, with this set, you would get uh, a red hat. You get gray hair. So you could turn this person here, say, for instance, with the glasses on into granny. She keeps losing her body. There you go, there's granny. Or you can put that hat on. Kind of looks like a um, train guard or a boat, uh, a sailor now. It's kind of cool. But for the sake of this, we're going to put your hair back on. There you go. And that's it, folks. Um, yeah, there's a few pieces left over, but it is yeah, basically it's a um, universal building set. Have a quick look at there we go there's our blue one kind of cool they got the bride the bride looks really cool let's try and the lights too bright huh there we go <laughs> the bride looks really cool and then we got Either the groom, or the father of the bride, or a gentleman. Look, could be a gentleman. And then we got this for this person here with a present, or something like that. Just a white brick for them. <laughs> <laughs> anyway folks if you enjoyed the video please give it a thumbs up if you didn't enjoy the video give it a thumbs down let us know why let us know in the comments uh your thoughts and um yeah any ideas uh we got uh, a few really exciting lego sets coming up um one of them being a galleon which is really cool i didn't realize i was that close to getting the parts for it we're at 74 percent at the moment so i was like whoa and just out of curiosity, I checked to see how many pieces I had to make the UCS Venator. I am 11% in, so I'm quite a way off. Quite a way off. But I'll keep you posted on that. All right. Thank you so much, folks. I'm Sean from Britain Bricks. Peace.